Hi everybody, I'm Philip Goodman from the Nevada Real Estate Group at Keller Williams Group 1 Inc. in Reno, Nevada. And this is going to be the first of what will be many conversations about mortgages. And our guest today is Robert Tinnen, loan originator of Integrity Mortgage Group. How are you doing, Robert? Good, man. How are you doing today? I'm doing fantastic, bro. So a lot of people who have never bought a home before, one of their first questions would be, Robert, as a loan originator, what factors do you use to determine whether or not somebody can qualify for a loan? You know, buying a home for the first time home buyers is a very daunting task, so I like to try to simplify it for them. There's three different factors we look at. Uh, first factor is going to be assets, which is going to be cash to close. So the category that we put for cash to close is going to be down payment, closing costs, that type of thing. Uh, the second aspect of it is going to be uh, debt to income ratio. So what we want to do is we want to make sure your total debt load is at least is no more than about half of what your monthly income is. And what qual what constitutes a person's debt load? Yeah, so so debt load is going to be your projected mortgage payment going to be any car payments you have, child support payments, student loans, student loans, credit cards, all those things. So basically anything that's going to report on a credit report. The third factor is going to be credit. We have to have a credit score that, you know, is a good credit score. If people are paying their bills on time, they're going to generally have a good credit score. And what is a good credit score these days? You know, you're looking at about 620. Anything? 620, that's it. Yep. Wow. So you can actually go down to about 500 on some programs. So Robert, if 600 is a good credit score, what can folks do if they're under 600? Well, well the number one thing you can do is manage your, uh, manage your credit card balances. So the, the biggest thing that swings credit scores is going to be your balance compared to your limit. So the general rule of thumb is try to keep your credit card balances at 30% of your overall limit. So quick math, $1,000 limit, you don't want your credit card balance to be over $300. Mm -hmm. Obviously, some of the other things you can do, too, is continue to make your payments on time. You never want to be 30 days late on anything because it really will ding your credit. Making sure that you pay things on time, doesn't it just apply to your credit cards, all of your utilities, and even your rent payments get reported to the credit bureaus? Absolutely. So let's tie this all together. Robert, we know now what you're looking for just to even qualify for that loan first. We know what we need to do to keep our credit good enough to qualify for the loan. But how do we get money for the down payment? So besides saving it up, which is probably really hard for people to do nowadays, there's a couple other options out there. So a lot of people have retirement accounts that they can um, pull from without being penalized because if they're using it for a first time home buyer program. The other option would be a gift from a family member or a close, close friend. The other option would be to use a down payment assistance program that the state of Nevada offers. Well, make sure you consult your tax advisor to get the limits of how much of a gift you can get without having to claim that on your taxes, as well as how much you can draw from your retirement account without being penalized for that. And for more information about those down payment assistance programs available throughout the state of Nevada, you should contact Robert. His information's in the YouTube description below. Well, Robert, I can't thank you enough for taking the time to talk with us and our viewers about what it takes to get qualified for a loan. And we will be back next month with another great mortgage topic. Awesome. All right, that'll do it for us this month from the Nevada Real Estate Group at Keller Williams Group 1 Inc. in Reno, Nevada. I'm Philip Goodman. He's Robert Tinnen. We'll see you next month.